happy to see folks celebrating at the uh, the Baker uh, headquarters. Yes. Sue, uh, let me, I beg your pardon. Let me hold you right there, because Richard Tissé is addressing uh, the supporters. Help me uh, every step of the way uh, for this uh, race, not only uh, for this election, but the journey that we've been on for the last three years. Um, I called Seth Moulton a little while ago and wished him well. Um, Seth has. I think most people know and who have uh, watched us interact, we both like each other. Um, and I'm very proud of the fact of the race that we ran and the, just the whole uh, tone and tenor of this race. A lot of people around the country looked to this congressional district as an example of the way a congressional race uh, should go, where you had two candidates who were exchanging ideas. Um, um, Seth has served his country very admirably and very honorably in the military, and I'm sure that he's going to do the same as the next congressman from this district. So I hope everybody here will, I told him uh, when I talked to him that he could count on me for any support that he needed to do a good job as the congressman for the district, and I would hope that the people here would give him that same support um, because he's going to need it going to Washington to help hopefully clean up the mess uh, that's down there. I have to um, really thank um, my husband, Bernie Starr, um, for being with me. Um, Bernie, um, um, Bernie has veto power over anything I do, and he gave me the green light uh, to do this. Um, public service is something that I have really enjoyed. Um, I am very proud of the time I served in the State Senate. I really do feel as though that um, the work that I did in the Senate uh, really helped improve people's lives, both on the state level where we passed education reform, welfare reform, we did so many good things, but also on a personal level. You know, I was at the Topsfield Fair not too long ago, and somebody came up to me and said, you know, 15 years ago you helped get my son into a group home. Uh, we had tried and tried and tried. We couldn't uh, uh, get anywhere. And we called you, and you were able to do that. And you ended up um, really improving his life and changing our whole family's life. And I always tell people that my favorite uh, movie, I watch it, I'll probably watch it tomorrow, as a matter of fact, <laughs> is It's a Wonderful Life. Uh, because when you watch that movie, um, it really gives you an idea of um, you know, what the world would be like if you weren't around. And I know that um, the time I've spent in public service, um, I have helped a lot of people and um, helped a lot of people move forward. Um, so let me just say this. Um, uh, three years ago, we started this campaign. Uh, we thought it was time for a new congressman. We got halfway there, <laughs> just not the congressman uh, we had hoped. Uh, uh, but I want to say that. Um, that I do think um, that we do face a lot of problems as a country right now, and it's important for both Democrats and Republicans to get together in Washington to try to solve those problems. I just want to thank everybody here. You know, so many people put uh, their time and their effort, just unbelievable um, amounts of energy, uh, into uh, helping me um, for a very long time. And I just want to let you know how much I appreciate it. My campaign manager, uh, Ryan Gooch, who's here. Um, Ryan, um, thank you. Um, um, Charlie Zold, my press secretary, who is just wonderful. Um, um, Ashley Korb, uh, who's here, has been with me uh, for quite a while. He's just terrific. PJ Karenkoff, who's here. Uh, Chelsea um, Newhouse. Um, we have just so many people. We have, we have had such a great team. And um, I feel very fortunate. Um, you know, when you run for Congress, you are invited into people's homes. You're invited into people's businesses. People share their personal um, dreams uh, and, you know, and aspirations with you. They tell you how difficult things are. Uh, in a lot of cases, um, you find out what their struggles are. And I just feel so blessed um, to have had the opportunity to be able to run for Congress uh, for this district, to be able to offer myself as a candidate. And I want to thank um, all of the people of the 6th Congressional District who have uh, for so long um, reached out and, and been so supportive of me. Um, and I just say thank you very much. And again, I want to congratulate Seth Moulton on a great victory. Thank you.
Well, Richard Tessay there conceding the race to Seth Moulton. Anyone who knows Richard Tessay well says how classy of an individual he is, and he certainly showed his class there, saying that he was very proud of the tone and tenor of the race that he had with Seth Moulton, who right now is a Marine and now a U.S. congressman as well, congressman-elect from the 6th District here in Massachusetts. I want to take a look now at the governor's numbers here in Massachusetts.